Welcome to the Sun Parlor Coffee House Sessions. I'm Jan Hall from Folk Roots Radio. Singer-songwriter Leah Maurice released a lovely live album, Live at the House of Harmony, in 2015. The album, which crosses over from folk to contemporary to light jazz, features Leah's warm voice on 12 songs that showcase her playful and charming lyrics. The album was recorded in the sanctuary of her converted church home in Fingal, Ontario, the House of Harmony, which doubles as the perfect rehearsal space, recording studio, and house concert venue. And Leah Maurice is our special guest in the Sun Parlor Coffee House Session studio today. She's coming up right now. Enjoy. This next song is called Tiny Trailer, and it is one that I wrote on the day that I was uh, recording my live album. I was sitting there just going over a few songs before I uh, before I had all the audience come and I was very inspired by the fact that that summer we were going to tour the album to out to Nova Scotia and so I wrote this song called Tiny Trailer. In a little tiny trailer for two let's go let's go to and in a little tiny trailer for two just me and you let's go I love to drive with you from coast to coast Checking out the sights we like to see the most When there's something special you see We'll stop and take a picture or two or three In a little tiny trailer for two Let's go, let's go to And in a little tiny trailer for two Just me and you, let's go we both love traveling out to the east You can have some steak, I'll have a lobster feast Watch the tide change by 35 feet And when we see a whale, that's a special treat In a little tiny trailer for two Let's go, let's go to And in a little tiny trailer for two Just me and you, let's go the northern camping trips are still the best Canoe all day at night beside the fire we rest Rocks and trees and water all around We love to sleep with such a peaceful sound In a little tiny trailer for two Let's go, let's go to And in a little tiny trailer for two Just me and you, let's go It's a comfy, cozy little getaway Board games at the table for two Looking at the stars I fall asleep with you Treasure of Memories is a brand new song uh, I've written, but I have not recorded until today. Um, and it was one that I wrote as part of a songwriting challenge. It started with the subject of, of getting rid of something that you should maybe get rid of. But when I got to thinking about it, I took it from a, a bit of a different angle. And I wrote about the things that I keep and the reasons that I keep them is because there are sometimes that having that object is what triggers a memory. And so sometimes if you get rid of that object, you might never have that memory triggered again. It's been a while Sitting there up on a shelf As years go by Sorry, I just can't let you go I want to keep you for myself I can't 
next song, Flowers in the Carpet, was one that I wrote a couple of years after I had the idea. Uh, at the time that I wrote the words down, I was going through a lot of stuff. But then by, by the time that I could actually finish the song, I was in a much better place. So you can kind of tell by the, the contradiction of the melody to the words in this song. Flowers in the carpet trampled down, trampled down. I am like the flowers in the carpet trampled down, trampled down. Ground right in. I am like the flowers in the carpet, trampled down, trampled down. I am like the flowers in the carpet, trampled down.
like the flowers in the carpet trample down Trample down, trample down. I'm like the flowers in the carpet. Trample down, trample down, Teddy Bear is a song from my first album called Take Me Anywhere, and I wanted to do this piece because it's an a cappella tune, and so if you want to snap along from home, go ahead. You see, I'm your cuddly teddy bear, you love to squeeze me, you know I care. But when you're upset, you take it out on me. You treat me like the rest, rip the stuffing from my chest. You do all this cause you know I'm still there. Your adorable, reliable, a teddy bear. Do, 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 do I. You wake in the night from a wicked nightmare. Neglected I wait, you yank me off of my chair. You hold me tight until your need is met. You think I have no heart, so me if I fall apart. You do all this cause you know I'm still there. Your lovable, squeezable, a teddy bear. Do, 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 do I. You play with your doll, delicate and so fair. Yeah, I understand, although I'd rather not share. So I sit back and watch you play the games. It's her you want to hold, though her heart seems cruel and cold. You do all this cause you know I'm still there. Your huggable, durable, a teddy bear. That's Leah Maurice with her partner, Mike Bojo, in the Quantum Sound Production Studio in Kingsville for another episode of the Sun Parlor Coffee House Sessions. Great to have you guys join Thank you so Thanks. much. It's great to be here. I'm a big fan of Leah's music. I mentioned at the start of the show, uh, she released her latest album, Live at the House of Harmony, in, I think, 2015? Yes. Recorded in, and this is the neat bit, recorded in her home, which used to be a church yes. and is now a wonderful rehearsal space, recording studio, and occasionally also a house concert venue. Yeah. Yeah. Very, very cool. Very we cool. We really like it. Yeah. 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 I love her music because of the way that she has a wonderful voice, but the way on the songs that you sing, which... Uh, are quite personal. You have the wonderful support from uh, your side player, who is also your life partner, Mike Bojo, on trumpet and cajon, and a little bit of guitar as well. And some also, if you watch the rest of the session, you'll know that he also is <laughs> adapt with his fingers. He can snap. Yeah, he can snap. <laughs> he can snap. So tell us a little bit about your music. Tell us how you got started. Oh, well, I have just always loved singing. Um, since I was a child, I would, living on the farm, I lived in the Chatham area out on a farm, and uh, while I was doing chores, I would sing and make up songs, even then, you know, driving the tractor along, there's a lot of grass to be cut on the farm, and so I would just make up songs then, and so I just had always been singing, and then my mom uh, played guitar by ear, and she used to sing a bit when uh, she was younger, and then when... Uh, I was about 12, they bought me a little guitar, it was just kind of a small one, and uh, mom taught me, and so I was also playing by ear, and so we would sing songs together and, and uh, harmonize and play guitar together, so I've just always loved singing and playing. And did you start songwriting fairly early on? Then? Yeah, like even when I was 12, I, I had started making up songs immediately, like I would play some songs that I 
learned that, that my mom knew, but uh, I, I've always just liked making them up, and some of them were really lame. But, uh, you know, <laughs> you're a kid. You're in your yeah, 12. that's you right. Know, but I, like, I suppose you have to like, have the... The confidence to, to right. try. Yeah. Right. And I think, you know, by the time I was uh, early 20s, then, like, I thought, oh, like, write a song and, and actually write it down and practice it a few times, not just sort of like, I'm making up this song right now. Yeah. So, yeah. Do, do you find it easy to write songs? or is it Sometimes, yeah. yeah. Um, a lot of times I, I find that I'm just, I'm inspired by something and I just have to sit down, write that minute and just write it. And, uh, and those are the times they come out really smooth. Um, I also love the challenge of doing songwriting challenges um, because it gives you a deadline and it, it sparks things. And so sometimes you have to research a little or you just kind of, it just makes you think. And uh, how, can I, how can I put my personality into this phrase or subject or whatever? And so I really enjoy doing those. And, and a couple of songs on the last album were through a songwriting challenge. So, yeah. One of the songs I love was actually the first song you played today in that tiny trailer, which um, after this session, I'll be heading home and I'll be driving down the road <laughs> singing tiny trailer. I don't have a trailer with me, but it's, it's a wonderful song. But whenever you sing it, you have the it, it, it just has a wonderful idyllic feel, you know, that we're off yeah. on vacation, especially in Canada. Yeah, because, you know, we do have these wide open spaces that you can explore. And the idea that you have this you know, very romantic um, notion of you know being yeah. in, in the trailer with well, your partner going places and that is one of the songs that like there are times when you sing a song and, and you you sing it and but you're not there you know it doesn't bring you back and that is a song that brings me back every time I sing it I can picture being in the trailer and you know riding with Mike and we're listening to podcasts and then you just like you pull over and you just get in and you sleep. And so it, it's great. And uh, luckily we travel well together, which is really good yeah. because <laughs> heading all the way to the East Coast uh, in a little trailer that, although it says it's 13 feet, it's the outside is 11 and the inside's about nine. So uh, nine foot squares. Is so you need, really need to be traveling with someone that you're comfortable with. Exactly. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. So good thing we do. Yeah. But uh, yeah, I, that really, that song really does... Uh, express my love of traveling and seeing things and and, uh, and that kind of feel. So, yeah. When I listen to that song, I wonder whether you don't have a children's album in you. Have you ever thought? No, because it's, it's yeah. the, that sort of song, whenever I listen to it, uh, I think, you know, if you made a children's album, you'd definitely put it on there. But oh, there's for something, sure. yeah. um, I don't know. I always have a smile on my face when I listen to it. And I think, Oh, yeah, Lee Marie's could so write children's songs. Have you ever tried that? I've written a couple, but I haven't done an album. I uh, I wrote one about bees about a year and a yeah. half or so ago, and I thought, oh, yeah, I could do this. Um, and I've done some children's festivals before with uh, playing as a side player with other people and doing harmonies and stuff. So I've, I'm, I do fit for the sound of playing for children and I think my voice is very comfortable for children to sing along as well and we've got a couple of friends who have what how old uh, uh, two and five two and five year old and like the one she she demands my album when they're on trips she's now accepted the second album <laughs> yes as an addition she was yeah. all about the first album yeah. at first um, it's been great to, to have you join us today Thank in the you. studio this album, mm -hmm. live at the House of Harmony, was recorded in this really neat space, as I mentioned before, right. the, this church in Fingal, Ontario. Mm -hmm. uh, tell me why you decided that you wanted to, to buy a church. Because we're crazy. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's funny because I'd actually thought about it for years and years, like not as a child, but young adult, really. I thought, oh, that would be fantastic to live in a church. And um, when Mike, Mike and I had been together, I don't know, probably like four years Maybe or so, four, yeah. and um, a, a friend, some friends of ours were talking about buying a property and stuff like that, and so we started talking about, yeah, like we should, you know, maybe buy something together. And uh, I said, you know what? And we were just, we were driving, and I said, you know what? I've always wanted to live in a church. And he's like, what? Me too. <laughs> and that started it. We looked for... Um, almost two years until we found this one and uh, and yeah just everything worked out just perfectly we, we really love it 
And I think you live downstairs, and then the sanctuary upstairs yep. is where you yeah. make music, you rehearse. Exactly, you, yeah. Uh, record. Because of the acoustics in that space are amazing. Um, so yeah. we've left the pews up there, and, and so it sort of looks like a sanctuary. We call it the sanctuary. Uh, and But the, the lower level, it doesn't feel like a basement. Uh, the windows come up, you know, like to here. So it, uh, it still has a brightness and homey feel to it. No, nice. that's great. It's been absolutely fabulous having you join us today. Today, you did play one new song as yes. part of the session. Mm -hmm. Are you working on a another album? I am. It might be a little bit of a slow process. I've actually got sort of two ideas in mind. I want to do a, a concept kind of album, and uh, then I want to just continue to write songs that uh, would be multiple themes to go on that's the great. next one as well. If people want to learn more about your music, how can they do that? Uh, you can check out my website, leahmaurice.com. Oh, that's great. We have time for one more song. Uh, what are you going to play for us? Uh, I think we'll play Highway 17. Perfect choice. Leah Maurice with Mike Bojo for the Sun Parlor Coffee House Sessions. And this is Highway 17. Highway 17 is a song that uh, I wrote with Mike's collaboration. I was on tour and for my first album out to Saskatchewan, and I was missing Mike terribly. And while I was driving on Highway 17, he had given me a, uh, a little snippet of a riff that he wrote on, and I was listening to it just playing on my flip phone. And when I got to Wawa, I was thinking about him, and I was inspired by being on Lake Superior, and uh, I wrote the song. Thousands of miles away Missing ya, miss Kissing ya I had a thousand things to say Needed to have some contact Even if just on screen I looked for your name On the rocks of Highway 17 Cause you fly me past the moon to the edge of heaven In your eyes love it shines so bright So bright I'm thankful for this time The chance that we've been given Could forever be just like tonight Tonight The wind had traveled towards you Treetops seem to sway Could it carry a message Of the things that I wrote down that day Flowing streams and rivers They knew just how I felt The seasons change, the warmth returns And my cold begins to melt As I drove on further, grayer grew the clouds I tried to imagine you in each and every crowd It's something I'd been dreaming, I knew I had to do But I couldn't taste your lips from there And the prairie air doesn't smell like you you fly me past the moon And to the edge of heaven 
In your eyes love it shines so bright So bright I'm thankful for this time The chance that we've been given Could forever be just like tonight Tonight But when I go away Although it may be brief I hurry my return I long for you I need relief I wanna hear your voice Whisper in my ear Good night my love Good night sweetness All my troubles disappear Cause you fly me past the moon And to the edge of heaven in your eyes, love, it shines so bright, so bright. I'm thankful for this time, the chance that we've been given could forever be just like tonight, 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 tonight. Could forever be just like tonight. Forever be just like tonight It was inspired by uh, the the blah, 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 take two. <laughs> <laughs>